morning. Morning. <laughs> you found the stash, huh? Wasn't well hidden. Okay, just for the record, that stuff's medicinal. I've got glaucoma. What are you talking about? Nothing. Morning. Morning. So where'd you disappear to last night? Me? I decided to take a little drive, give you a chance to calm down about Charity Kirschenbaum. I'm perfectly calm. Good. Who's Charity Kirschenbaum? Hey, it's just a little thing that's not worth getting upset about. And hey, what the hell are you doing with my cookies? <laughs> they're yours? You know they're mine. Oh, so you're saying I took something that belonged to you and you're upset? Oh. <laughs> Come on, Alan. I love Charity Kirschenbaum, and you stole her right out from under me. He's speaking metaphorically, right? <laughs> yeah, he was never on top of that. I would have been if it weren't for you. OK, fine. I took your girl 20 years ago. That calls for maybe five, six cookies, tops, not the whole damn bag. <laughs> I had to go to junior prom with cousin Phoebe. She was cute. She was 12 and in a body cast. Oh, so what? She was your cousin. She could have been 18 and in a cellophane bikini and you weren't going to get any. You are a horrible human being and I hope you burn in hell. So we're good? No! We are not good! We suck! Let's freshen that up for you. Thanks. Hi, Judith. Jake, your mom's here. Did you talk to him? I did. Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. How's it going? Great. Uncle Charlie's a genius. Good, good. You said you talked to him. I did. Then why is Uncle Charlie a genius? Because he never got married. <laughs> oh, that's going to come back to bite me in the ass. <laughs> and here it comes. Jaws a snapping. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Why are you sorry? I just find it's easier that way. Okay. Is Charlie at home? Oh, no, he, uh, he went out a couple of hours ago. Oh, I've been trying to call him on his cell, but he doesn't answer. Please tell him I stopped by. Uh, sure, sure thing. Gabrielle. Oui? Um, forgive me if I'm out of line, but I sense a loneliness inside you. Is it so obvious? I'm right. Oh, well, yes. But how could you know? We're two of a kind. I myself have tasted the saltiness of lonely tears. Oh, poor petit. We have much to share. Oh, we do indeed. Come on in. First his cookies, now his croissant. Hey. Oh, hello, Charlie. Gee, how embarrassing. What are you talking about? Oh, dear. This is so difficult. No, it's not. Go ahead. Tell him. Tell him. Charlie, you are a wonderful man, but your brother, he really understands me. So, what are you saying? It's just... I... I can't. I can't. She's dumping you for me. Ha ha. Oh, this is so awkward. I must go. Please, forgive me. Huh? Huh? How's it feel? I'm stunned. Good, good. What else? You snaked my girlfriend? Yes, I did. I snaked her. Like a cobra. And you did it just to hurt me? Well, not just to hurt you. Well, yeah, just to hurt you. I don't know what to say. I'm crushed. That's good. Say that. I'm crushed. <laughs> My own brother purposefully set out to hurt me. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. You're not taking this away from me. What, what about you and Charity Kirschenbaum? I was 17, Alan. I was a horny idiot. But you, you're an adult. OK, I, I see where you're going, and it's not going to work. You're not taking this away from me. I really thought our relationship had grown beyond this petty crap. 
I thought I could count on you. I thought you were my friend. Son of a bitch, you took it away from me. <laughs> Thank you.